This is why narcissists are less committed to their partners the longer they're together. Narcissists will assure you they will treat you like royalty and promise you a bright future as a way to entice you. They might tell you the name of the cute restaurant they're sure you'll love, the names of the romantic cities they visited, or even the number and names of the children they plan to have with you. Their positive attitude remains constant, especially during the love-bombing phase. However, the chance of eventual reality is a crucial difference between future planning and future faking. You have turned a crossroad that will lead you to depression rather than happiness. Things might quickly deteriorate if a narcissist concludes that you are madly in love with them and will do anything for them. There is less of a rush since because narcissists are no longer actively engaged in a state of perpetual pursuit. Is commitment phobia a real thing for narcissists? That's what we're going to find out in today's video. Must we suppose that they desire it? I was curious how much of it they actually have. Marriage, committed relationships, strong family ties, intimate friendships, and effective work partnerships are all things that individuals seek, but not in the case of narcissists. That's why I'm going to explore the reasons why narcissists tend to be uncommitted, as well as the worth of commitment to them. On the other hand, let's pause for a moment before continuing. Welcome, everyone. Thank you for your time to check out this video. If this is your first time here, I encourage you to subscribe and activate the notification bell so that you will be the first to know when we upload new videos. For starters, let me define commitment. A commitment can be anything from a vow to aid someone in need to a promise to always be there for someone. In this scenario, the latter portion is more significant because narcissists value relationships love and commitment so highly, but not in a conventional way. Narcissists want your undivided focus and devotion regardless of the type of your relationship with them, be it platonic, sexual, or familial. They genuinely need you to stay for as long as possible. All three of these attributes are important for maintaining a promise. Discipline and commitment are the bedrock of any lasting friendship or romantic relationship. Commitment is crucial in any love connection but narcissists only want you to be committed to them. And to their warped minds, that is perfectly acceptable. It's typical for narcissists to think of themselves more highly than they truly are. Someone like that may talk a good game about dedication, but their behaviors betray any real conviction. What this illustrates is that narcissists aren't frightened of settling down for the long run. They expect it, they want it, but they can't give it to themselves. Unfortunately, narcissists aren't very excellent at committing to their loved ones. The reason for this is because narcissists have a hard time relating to others. They can't feel sympathy for you at all. Because of this, narcissists only feel brief emotions toward the people they date and then soon discard them. They are vacuous, fake demonstrations of affection. When a narcissist makes a promise, it is usually merely to make the listener feel better, as they know they won't be able to keep it. While the narcissist is busy seeking new supplies, they will utilize the word commitment to encourage you to invest more effort into the relationship. A narcissist can only sustain a short-term commitment to people and things that further their own goals. When something more tempting comes along, interest, passion, and dedication all go. Narcissists, in a nutshell, don't survive long in commitment. By closing your eyes, it goes away, but they'll use gaslighting to make you think differently. Narcissists aren't capable of settling down with one person. They are emotionally stunted and shun commitment as a result. However, narcissists are always exhibiting the ideal in an effort to persuade us that it actually exists. It's easy to fall into the narcissist's demands and go along with their requests if we convince ourselves that they actually care about us. Narcissists, like the rest of us, long for meaningful connections with others and the security that comes with committed romantic partnerships. They want everything we have to offer, yet they won't pay us for it. They would do nothing to achieve their goals if they believed they could get away with doing whatever they wanted. As I've said before, your happiness isn't the point. What you desire and need is not important, and you will not receive any attention from them. The narcissist always gets what he or she wants. Actually, love, happiness, and all the good stuff bore the narcissist in the end. What they realize is, who needs commitment when they can have control. However, narcissists appear to devote their whole lives to spreading lies and boosting their exaggerated feeling of self-importance. To the extent that you let them, they will harm you as well. 
Keeping yourselves constantly under them is their number one priority. As a result, they care largely about how it will affect them individually. How exactly can this aid you in continuing with your life? Narcissists are not selfless and will breach promises they make to others over the long run if they don't immediately benefit them. Narcissists aren't hesitant to settle down and establish a family, but this is only because they think it will profit them. Also, rejection is really painful for this individual. So, narcissists will play the martyr or the martyrdom avoider to win our allegiance and avoid being rejected. Narcissists are brilliant performers who can convince others that they are committed while never actually committing themselves. That's all I can share with you right now. If you found this video beneficial, please show your appreciation by liking and sharing it with your friends or family members. Furthermore, let me know what you're thinking in the comment section below. Please consider subscribing to our channel and pressing the bell button below for future videos. We appreciate you watching this.